Okay, so um, engage your core is something we all are saying we're all familiar with, and you'll hear if you're following my videos, you'll hear me hear me say that before a lot of exercises. So how how do we actually do it, and how do we know that we're doing it right? Well, there's two methods. Okay, so for the first method, I'll use Derek to show you. So what you do for method one is if you put your hands on your hips and you reach forward, you will find two bony prominences sticking out at the front of your hips. So if you walk around, you'll find these here, they're called the ASIS and they're quite prominent on most people. And all you would do is you'd take your fingers, find those points and then just lightly sink into the soft tissue either side of them. So you've got your fingers just resting in there, okay? Then what you would do is you think about your belly button, so here's your belly button, and then you would think about drawing it down towards the spine and then up towards the rib cage. okay? So, I mean, really be lying down to do this, but you find your ASIS, sink in, think about your belly button, draw it back towards the spine and then up to the rib cage. And as you do that, what you should feel under your fingers is like a band tighten. It's almost like a, like a belt push up into your fingers or you feel the muscular contraction. And what that is, that is your TVA. Yeah, so your TVA is very, very deep. Yeah, it's your deepest abdominal muscle. And that's about the only place you can feel it and feel it contract. Okay, so it's a good confirmation that you know you've actually engaged it. Okay, without being able to feel that, it just almost says, you know, pull your belly button in and up. You could do that all day and you're like, well, am I actually doing it right? Having your fingers there will give you that confirmation that you are actually doing it correctly. So that's method one. So that method I would use for something more static, uh, like a plank position or something like that, or something slow and controlled. Method two is the more simple one, which you're doing something a bit more active. And that's just imagine someone's going to punch you in your belly, right? And then you just brace you just brace against that force, that, that impact that you're expecting, okay? There's a debate about which one's better. Um, that's for people with more time on their hands than me, but the kind of research is showing there's not a lot of difference, okay? There's not a lot of difference between the activation of the, of the core and the abdominals of the TVA, between the drawing in maneuver and the brace maneuver, okay? So when I say engage your core, that that is what you should be doing.